of course, education and charitable work is part of the core elements of All Tech. How does Give Kids a Chance program fit in with that principle? What it does really is, you know, education and involvement would be the first and last of the four pillars of All Tech. And Give Kids a Chance was a great opportunity to link our partners, our, our customers, our, uh, our friends into this program and, and get them a chance to be involved in bringing in all the students uh, that we brought in. Looks like we're going to have about 70,000 students in. Um, we're extremely excited about that and, and you can see them running around the place and, and the, the expressions on their face and the, and the response really is the, is the feedback. We've been in touch with all of the schools. We're, we've given them information and questions and we're, we're looking forward to seeing what, they, what the kids picked up from this. Um, of course, our, our Kids Own project is something that we think will be a great opportunity to get that involved and, and they've been exposed to it here bring that forward and say, why don't we make that part of Kentucky's curriculum, teach children about agriculture and where their food comes from. Well, Billy, you've been responsible for bringing these children from all across the state of Kentucky. How did you go about that? Well, it's a team effort, first of all, and it's a daunting task. When Dr. Lyons get, threw down the gauntlet and said, we need to bring all these kids in, give every kid in Central Kentucky a chance to come to the games, we went right to work and worked with the superintendents and got the tickets out there, ordered the tickets, and now, as you can see around me, the kids are here. Well, this also brings them into Old Tech's Give Ch Kids a Chance program. Tell us about that, Billy. Well, what we're doing here is we really, there's a disconnect, fundamental disconnect between the farm and the consumer, the farmer and the consumer. And so what we're doing here is when the kids arrive, I ask them all, how many of you guys ate breakfast this morning? They all raise their hand. All right. And so for, do, for those of you that ate breakfast, you can thank a farmer because a farmer is responsible for your, the food that's on your plate. How many of you guys like science? Oh, we all love science. All right, so you're gonna see how we work with farmers and how we use science working with farmers in here. And oh, by the way, a farmer paid for your ticket today. So those of you that have a full belly and a good time, you can thank a farmer. And that's what agriculture is doing today, really stepping up to help these kids.